Hello everyone. This tutorial based on how to achieve or how to create an offset with plan suite. What I mean by the offset is that the distance between the existing item of work or existing building to the end point of new item of work. For example, if you want to take off for, for site clearance, for some site clearance, and do want to cover all the area of the land, you want to cover only the shape, the perimeter of the building. And now, you want to add an extension to it, like maybe instead of the perimeter of the building, you want to add like 1.2, like extension. Let me mark it out there. Be from this point to this point, 894. 894. You understand? All through the perimeter of the building. That is the offset of what you want to work on or to take off. So, this offset can be done for site clearance, for excavation, and concrete work. And the reason I want to, I'm, crea I'm creating this, this video is that one of my YouTube subscribers requests for it. So let me show you this question, how I chat up. Yeah, he said, if we are only given white color, that's the white color, this is the existing perimeter, the existing external point of the item of wood. So this is the white and he said if you are only given white color sketches and if you want the offset to be 150mm or 200mm then how to calculate the answers so that is what we're going to do right now so now what i'm going to do now is that i'm going to create a template and the template i'm going to make use of linear tools just name this one as site clearance. Site clearance. Yeah, site clearance. Click on advanced. I'm going to need width for the extension. I have to check the width. Then is a meter. Yeah. Take off. Activate the take off formula. Linear total. Multiply with the width, drag and drop it in square meter. Square meter, and check all this. Yeah. So now the quantity underestimated, you have to change it to square meter also for the results. Now come down to layout. Just click on this width to show the units. Click on form. So you are done with it template click on ok come back to home I'm coming ok it's under concrete here yeah. and yeah okay. you can make it separate so stand on its own yeah so now come back to home. Okay, good. Click on it, size clearance. So let us use 600 mm as the offset 0 0.6. Just to be picking edges. Yes, done. Not big one down to this Click on escape. So we are done. Surely, okay. You get twenty four point four square meter for side clearance. So we are done with the side clearance. Let us take off or let us create a template for 
excavation excavation what i'm going to do is just copy this one and paste it understand just rename it as trench excavation understand same that they came into the concrete a concrete works so click on advanced what i'm going to do that is that i'm going to add the depth to excavate how to add the depth so um yeah so click on the takeoff formula click on multiplication drag the depth drag it come back to form layout and click on just pick this one at the front of the depth okay click on form so now the units we change to cubic meter same type cable to quantity under estimate the cubic meter yeah click on okay come back to home you can add this yeah click on it the depth does use 400 does use 400 mm or does use 300 the width you still maintain the design that you use you still maintain the design you can use yeah we trace it the same way we did for the side clearance still i'm still going to work on circle you can escape so what do you get okay 7.3 cubic meter so same thing our same procedure applicable to concrete work what to do for the trench excavation i'm going to do for the um concrete work just change the depth or the thickness so now let me use let me now um take off for offsets for the circle so now size clearance for the offset of circle let me use the same 600 so let me start from here and for the ladies yeah size clearance 600 yeah click ok and pick it from here can you see now that it's straight and horizontal so click on a on your keyboard that means stand for circle and arc so click on this midpoint points now click on the last point for the hack you are still continuing you are still proceeding can you see that it's still is as it has returned back to the vertical and horizontal. So click on A again to return back to the arc. Click on escape. So now it remains this V shape. I mean, it remains this V or triangular shape. So to calculate for this one, what to take off for this one, just get a 9. You can name it if you like. Just pick it out. Pick it out, pick it out. You understand me? Now come back to it be the side clearance. Side clearance, yeah. Sorry. Side clearance, yes, yeah. side clearance, yes. Yeah. Okay. Just trace it out. Trace it out. Trace it out. Click on escape. So now addition of this, addition of this one, what we got here with the new one that we did, we have done. Just add it together. You got 0.03 square meter and what of this one get one point for this one coming 
size clearance is 15, 15.7, 15.7, I'm scaring that, let me check, size clearance, or oh, something is wrong, come size clearance, okay, this is the last one, 0, 0.0, Nothing's wrong. I, I, I think it is here. It's 0 0.03, not 0 0.0. So you can check the quantity here. Diligent. Or with the label. So right click. Click on show label. So 0 0.03 is the quantity of this one. What of this? Click on this show label. So it's 9.42. Let me check it here. Size clearance, let me drag it so that we're able to see it clearly. 9.42 square meter. So, it seems applicable to, applicable to the um, concrete work or threat excavation. If you want to take off or threat excavation for this circle, just come back here, threat excavation. What to use for this? The other one we use three right? Three hundred. This one we use six hundred. Click OK. This is starting point. Don't forget to click on A to activate the arc. Click on this midpoint, last point. We are done with the arc that we activate. So to proceed, click on A again. Click on the midpoint and click on the last point and press escape let me add this one so come back to the trench excavation here then use the other yeah so then just trace it out trace it out okay. so now what do you get this one let me show it let me show it Show legion, I show legion. So for this one is 0 0.01 cubic meter, cubic meter. Yes, the other one for this one is let me check 2.83 cubic meter. I think I've solved the question ask me as in one of my youtube subscribers you are free to ask any question if you know that you didn't understand or last week. so our next training our next tutorial is on pile excavation pile excavation and concrete work thanks for watching